We've been running Bimshaw Live now for, this is our sixth year. When we started out, we wanted to be at the cutting edge of digital construction in the UK. And what we want to do this year is make sure we go back to our roots, level three, digital built Britain starting out, and um, we want to make sure we're at the forefront again. We've also got a great venue here, a very special venue. We're in the boiler shop, which is where Stevenson's rocket was designed and built. The content, the most passionate content comes from the guys that are most passionate and the, the people that live and breathe it. So that tends to promote or foster a community sort of spirit. The great thing about the BIM community, and I think it is that, is that people are willing to be open. There's such a sort of groundswell of enthusiasm that they share ideas. And from that, you get sort of better product coming back out of it. So I'm always hugely heartwarmed when I see these group of people together. How do we make the world better by doing things in a different way? And BIM fits that brief perfectly. This event fits that brief perfectly, actually, because there are so many boring conferences, and this isn't a boring conference. It's super exciting. If you're not embracing BIM, then I think you're stuck in the old way of doing things, and you have to take a long look at how you're running your business, because ultimately, like it or not, we are a digital industry, from the smallest architectural practice to the largest we're a digital industry and if you don't embrace new tools and technologies, you will become obsolete. We're very happy about uh, the program, we're very happy to see new exhibitors, we're happy to learn about the new software available in the market, so uh, it's very good and uh, we're very excited to be here. No, I've always learned so much from these events um, and it's, it's, it's strange to think that now I'm presenting at them, so yeah, no, really worthwhile. It's really exciting with the um, push of smart cities and digital transformation and where this is all going to go over the next one, two, five years. It's really going to start to expand now. We're getting that critical mass of people and kind of getting on board with BIM Digital kind of moving forwards. Delighted that it's here in the northeast in Newcastle. We know there's so many companies here who have expertise in BIM. So to have this event here, bring audiences here to see them and showcase that expertise that's here in Newcastle and the North East is fantastic. People have travelled from all over the country, literally all over the world, to come and speak. We've got a guy from Australia who's, who wants to come and tell his story in Newcastle, which, you know, how fantastic is that? For me, one of the big things about BIM Show Live, it comes a great opportunity to network, but also for people to share and exchange their stories. I generally think by coming along, it's going to advance your journey, or at least help you get onto the, the BIM ramp. Everyone's excited about looking at innovation, robotics, artificial intelligence. Everyone's excited about moving things forward further.